Hey guys, we're back. Uh, we got another book for you today. Uh, this was a highly requested book by the fans. Uh, it's Dragons Love Tacos by Adam Rubin. And um, yeah, I haven't read this book, so it'll be a new one for me. It'll be, uh, it looks pretty interesting, but uh, we'll give a few minutes here, let everybody uh, join up and get in, and, and so they can all um, be on here for the reading. But uh, heading into Darlington this weekend, uh, one of my favorite tracks for sure. Uh, you know, had had some great runs there, able to win a couple of years ago. Um, you know, so hopefully we go back and have another strong run. Um, the track, you know, they've uh, paved a big section in one and two, um, as some of you may or may have not seen. Uh, so it, it, it's probably going to be quite a bit different, but um, should be interesting. It'll be fun to uh, to get out there and learn it. And the Southern 500 is you know, always such a cool race. I mean, you know, really one of the biggest ones of the year. So, uh, hopefully just have a strong run and, you know, be up front and have a shot at it. It'd be, uh, be a big one to win. So we'll go ahead and get into the book. This is Dragons, uh, Love Tacos. Hey kid, did you know that dragons love tacos? They love beef tacos and chicken tacos. They love really big, gigantic tacos and tiny little baby tacos as well. Why do dragons love tacos? Maybe it's the smell from the sizzling pan. Maybe it's the crunch of the crispy tortillas. Maybe it's a secret. Either way, if you want to make friends with dragons, tacos are key. Hey dragon, why do you guys love tacos so much? There's our big dragon friend. But wait, as much as dragons love tacos, they hate spicy salsa even more. They hate spicy green salsa and spicy red salsa. They hate spicy chunky salsa and spicy smooth salsa. If the salsa is spicy at all, the dragons can't stand it. There's a kid and his dog right there. No spicy salsa. Why do dragons hate spicy salsa? Well. Just one drop of hot sauce makes a dragon's ears smoke. Just one single speck of hot pepper makes a dragon snort sparks. Spicy salsa gives dragons the tummy troubles, and when dragons get the tummy troubles, oh boy. If you want to make tacos for dragons, keep the toppings mild. Tomatoes, lettuce, cheese, all good toppings for tacos for dragons. Hey dragon, how do you feel about spicy taco toppings? He doesn't look too impressed about the spicy toppings idea. Dragons love parties. They like costume parties and pool parties. They like big gigantic parties with accordions and tiny little parties with charades. Why do dragons love parties? Maybe it's the conversation. Maybe it's the dancing. Maybe it's the comforting sound of a good friend's laughter. There's all the dragons partying it up. The only thing dragons love more than parties or tacos is taco parties. Taco parties are parties with lots of tacos. If you want to have some dragons over for a taco party, you'll need buckets of tacos. Pant loads of tacos. The best way to judge is to get a boat and fill the boat with tacos. That's about how many tacos dragons need for a taco party. After all, dragons love tacos. Hey dragon, are you excited for the big taco party? Just remember, dragons hate spicy salsa. Before you host your taco party with dragons, get rid of all the spicy salsa. In fact, bury the spicy salsa in the backyard so the dragons can't find it. That's a lot of tacos. These dragons love your taco party. They love the music, they love the decorations, they especially love the tacos. Congratulations. It's a good thing you got rid of all that spicy... Wait a second, what are those little green things in the salsa? You didn't read the fine print? Dragons, listen to me. Do not eat those tacos. They are 
So those little green specks in the salsa, those are jalapeno peppers. They are super spicy. I know you love tacos, dragons, but you're not going to love those tacos. Do not let those dragons eat those tacos. Crunch, crunch, crunch. I think they're eating the tacos. Too late. The dragons ate the tacos with the spicy salsa. Just not good. Burned the whole house down. Why would dragons help you rebuild your house? Maybe they're good Samaritans. Maybe they feel bad for wrecking it. Maybe they're just in it for the taco breaks. After all, dragons love tacos. Well, there we go. Just learned about how much dragons all love tacos so much. Um, it was a good book, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, and thanks for tuning in and doing the read with, uh, with Eric with me. And uh, I you know, enjoy doing these, so make sure you guys are uh, sending in your suggestions for books. Uh, the best way for us to see them is to hashtag read with Eric. And uh, we'll get on there and check out your guys' books and put together the next one for the next video. And hope you guys uh, enjoy it. So thanks for tuning in. Uh, make sure to catch the race this weekend at Darlington for the Southern 500. And I'll see you guys all again soon.